We're here with uh, Darnell Boone on the eve of uh, the next biggest fight of your career, taking on Adonis Stevenson in a big rematch here at the Bell Center. Uh, it's a big rematch for him. He's yeah. the guy with a lot on the line, and, and he very easily could have pulled out of this fight uh, and gone on to a bigger fight in June. Uh, what are your thoughts of this fight? That him, him giving that everything that he got going on in his career, I personally think it was it was the the saddest mistake that they made. Well, the reason why I say sad is because why would you go back to a guy that knocked you out when you got all this going on? Because you can't come in here and just say, "Well, I could beat him." Now you got to prove that. You know what I'm saying? So. It's going to be a lot of pressure on him because now he got to prove to his fans that it was a fluke. He got to prove to himself that it was a fluke, which he knew it wasn't, you know. He keeps saying, well, he wasn't ready and all this and all these excuses. I don't even care about that. But when you step in that ring, being undefeated, you got to treat every fight like it's a championship fight because in boxing, anything can happen. And you got to train well. You got to be conditioned, and you got to have all your wits about you because you never know what can happen. You just said about him not being ready. You're actually one of those guys. You're the king of take, taking fights on a few days, a few weeks' notice. This time, I understand, this is one of the first times you've had a six-, seven-week training camp. Oh, man. Training camp been great. I'm talking about I, I got, got the most awesome trainers the most awesome sparring partners. I trained so hard for this. And my confidence is through the roof, you know, because I know I got ten, a time and I had a chance to work and get to what, what I am today, you know, which before I was training myself. You know, even though I had trainers, I was training myself because they didn't care. They probably lost faith in me years ago, you know. So I'm... I'm coming with a, it's going to be a new me, new Darnell Boone that they're fighting tomorrow night. You said it's a new you. I think it's been a new Adonis Stevenson maybe since your loss. Does the first fight mean anything once the bell rings tomorrow night? No. I will let go out the window. It's, it's the now syndrome. So everything goes on what, what's going to happen tomorrow night. You kept saying how much this fight means to you. You know, we look at your record. It's not the prettiest record in the world. But in a sense, is tomorrow night you're fighting a guy, Adonis Stevenson, who may be fighting for the light heavyweight championship of the world in a couple months. Is this a champion? Is this Darnell Boone's championship fight? No, I treat it just like any other fight. You know, I like fighting. I love the sport. You know, so win, lose, or draw is not about a win to me. I want to give the fans, the reporters, and everybody a fight that they're coming to pay to see, and. And, you know, all, all y'all work hard, you know, so to come see a fight and somebody just get mauled over 20 seconds, 30 seconds, that's that's robbing y'all of the experience of the boxing world. So I want to give the fans what they pay, what they want to pay to see, you know. They want to see somebody that that can fight. They want to see somebody that got heart. Yeah, if the knockout come, yeah, they'll, they'll do that a lot, but they want to see somebody with some pizzazz. You know, that's going to that's gonna make them say, oh, I want to see that guy fight again, regardless if he lose or win. We've seen you in the ring. You beat Stevenson. You've uh, beat some other guys, knocked down on reward, held some other undefeated guys to draws and whatnot. I just read a quote from you. Uh, and this fight's being broadcast on our network on Well TV. That someone did their homework to give a guy with your record main event status. Uh, expand on that. Right. Uh, because most times when I fight a guy that's of caliber, it's always somebody that's the co-feature or the Calibre main event. Part, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I'm always the one that's overlooked. So for somebody to actually give me the chance to, even with the losses I got, to give me a main event, you know, my hat's off to them because they actually like, okay, we got to get this guy on TV. This guy can fight. He, he going to give us what we've been looking for. Well, this fights me air live at 7 p.m., Eastern uh, on Well TV. What do you want to say back to the fans in the United States? Uh, just thank you for just supporting me and and just being there for me. And, and I fight for y'all. You know, I fight, I fight for my family, the fans, and my friends. You know, my city. You know, so 
I just want to give him the best show that I can give him. Well, Darnell, we'll see you tomorrow night in our main event against Adonis Stevenson. We wish you best of luck. Uh, thank you. Thank you.